Hey, how's everyone doing? It's a lot of people seem to like that core complex from Wednesday, Thursday. How are those abs feeling today? Well, your Friday warm up, uh, it's a minute on the clock, uh, basic stuff. Uh, you guys should know these pretty well. Um, the workout, let's talk about the workout. This is a lot of stuff going on. I uh, wanted to make sure it was nice and big on the TV screen, so I got rid of the explanation. So the explanation is on the warm up sheet, right? But I'm gonna go over this in detail. So, trainers out there, just make sure you're uh, fully aware that you will have to probably give a little expert explaining, make sure everyone's on the right page. Now, it's uh, color coded on the big screen, but uh, here's all black and white, so you can't tell. There's two different sections, right? We got the A section. Right, there's four lines and the B section, there's four lines. We're gonna stick with A, okay? And you got side one and you got side two, right? And you got the middle exercise, the big ME there in the middle. So we're gonna do four rounds of A. You start with the kettlebell curl press extension, do the middle exercise, side plank crunch, and then you do side two, supermans, right? And then you go back to side one, swings, round one, side plank crunch, and then plank step ups, a half moon squat, round one, side plank crunch, one legged reach, so on and so forth. So that's round one. You're gonna do all eight exercises with the middle exercise always being the side plank crunch. Round two, same exercises, one and two, but we do cross climbers in the middle. Round three, spider climbers, round four, burpees. Okay, so I might, it seems like it may be a bit a lot, but you know, the reps are kind of low here on the outside, the middle exercises ones that should go by fast, and then we'll do the same thing all over again for B, four new exercises. Again, on the screen, it'll be color-coded. Uh, middle exercises have a different color. A and B have a different color. Hopefully, it all makes sense, so let's see what this all looks like again. All right, so you warm up, jump rope, jumping jack, whatever you want. We've got a couple new jump ropes, uh, gang, and uh, the ones with the plastic, hard plastic handles, uh, weighted, so if you're looking for a little extra work, uh, you get those, the regular red and black ones, and uh, a, couple, get a couple new ones around, so you should be good. Um, where are we at? Lunge reach, right? Hey, maybe we do that, we got a sumo. Your plank swings, again, just to warm up, you know, keep those both hands down. Then we go to a shoulder stretch. See here, a lot of people like to do this shoulder stretch, so if you're down on the ground anyways, you know, get that nice shoulder stretch in, and get across or over. I like to put my hand on my back hip, and then really get that, that's a good stretch. Right there, go ahead, do it right now. I dare you, right there, you can see it. You get a doorway, put that on, and get that nice stretch. All right, shoulder stretch. Side lunge to your instep. Another kind of new one is your lying leg hug with a spinal twist, right? So you get that good hug. So you're hugging it first, then you try to get your elbow over the knee and add that little spinal twist. That uh, feels so good. I gotta do both sides. I can't just stretch on one side. It throws me all off. Can't do that. All right, after that, we do our high knees, heel kicks, chest to knee, knee to chest, and then jack the box or jump rope again if you want. All right, so I explained the format. And we'll go over it again with you in class tomorrow. Um, kettlebell, so our kettlebell exercise. So you can use a kettlebell, a dumbbell, even a slam ball can be used. So you wanna get a couple different weights, only one single of any particular weight. If you wanna get a couple different weights, right? We have our curl, press extension, you guys know these. You got your swings, right? You got your half moon with a squat. So you go half moon, squat, half moon, and squat weight on your side. And then your mountain chop, okay? Let's go up top and that's one. All right, so those are, that's A on one side. Uh, a on the other side, we got the Supermans. I think you guys know these, all right? Plank, step up. So what we're gonna do with that one, it's an upper plank. You get your steps out and we're just gonna go up, up, down, down. That's one. So you get 12 of those, up, up, down, down. Kind of switch which arm you go up with. Uh, every other or halfway through switch, single legged reach, right? A little break here, and then you got your squat jumps. So, those are the main exercises for the A set. Now, the middle exercises round one, you get your side plank and crunch, head aside. The then, you got your cross climbers. Make sure you guys can see me, I want to make sure I'm in frame. Cross climbers, right knee to opposite elbow, spider climbers, get that foot up by your hands. Just 10 of those, and then round four is gonna be your burpees. 
okay? And then we're gonna our B set, okay? Again, dumbbell, kettlebell, clean, and lunge, all right? You get your halo, keep that thing at level, halos, side plank row, probably a dumbbell needed for your side plank row, and then weighted step ups. Why don't you put your hands on two weights, and you get your 12 weighted step ups. There, onto the side two. Push up with the toe touch, right? You push up, bring the toe underneath, opposite hand touches. You got eight of those, four aside. Now you touch, shuffle touch. We all have our 14 foot boxes. So just gonna touch your line, shuffle across, touch your other line, shuffle across, touch your line. All right, stay low as you go back and forth. So we get six of those every time you touch. One, two, three. So three going one way, three going the other way. Single leg box squats, right? Sitting down on one, standing back up, and then skaters to finish that set of two. And then your middle exercises, we have our seated side crunches, right? I will abbreviate a lot. Again, I want to make sure it's nice and big on the TV screen. So your SS, seated side crunches, right? Ten on each side. Then we've got our two foot lateral steps, up on and over. Round three, bike, bicycle, crunch. Right, and then we finish with our VSJs, box squat jumps. Only 10 of them, don't need to do a burpee, just the box squat jumps. All right guys, that is your Friday, Saturday workout. Looks like another fun one. All right, stay tuned, we'll see you on Friday.